Hello and welcome to our System 8 Applications video. For over 30 years, ABI Electronics has been the leading designer and manufacturer of cost-effective and time-saving test, measurement and fault-finding equipment. In this video, we will show you some of the most popular features of our System 8 product range. First of all, what's System 8? ABI System 8 is a modular product range dedicated to the test, measurement, fault-finding and repair of virtually any type of analog or digital PCB. The tests can be carried out at component level as well as at PCB level. The fact that the system is modular, it means ABI can offer a solution that will meet your needs and requirements. The System 8 Automate software controls all the modules and their tools that can be used as a standalone or as part of an interactive test sequence called the test flow. The test flow manager will allow you to save test results as well as instrument setup, pictures, videos and test instructions in a computer file that can be shared or stored for future reference. At the end of a test, a comprehensive report is generated providing detailed information about any fault found during the test. If you're asking yourself how you can test or repair a PCB using System 8, we will show you some of the most common tests that will provide your business with the fault coverage needed to quickly spot the faults and repair PCBs. Some of the following tests require power, whilst others are completely power off as indicated by the icons you're seeing on the screen. The PCB you are seeing is a real-life sample that brings a variety of devices technologies and interfaces, very similar to most cases found on industrial PCBs these days. Our engineers selected a range of tests that are available exclusively on the System 8 range that would allow any repair engineer or technician to troubleshoot a similar PCB. In real life, ABI customers around the world started the troubleshooting process running a range of power-off non-destructive tests and here are some of them. The signature analysis test is the most common and safest way of testing devices and PCBs without power. An AC signal is applied to a device and the current response with reference to ground is measured and plotted as a voltage against current graph, producing a signature. This signature is specific to the device or a test point and we will view different types of faults such as leaky capacitors, shorts, broken tracks, internally damaged devices and more. The System 8 range offers the unique ability to automatically vary the output signal frequency whilst measurement is taking place. The result is plotted in 3D, demonstrating the impact of the frequency on the device under test. Several parameters can be adjusted and the results from the good board can be stored for later comparison. If you prefer, you can have good and bad boards side by side being compared in real time. A very convenient and time-saving way of using the signature analysis test is through clipping onto a given IC, digital or analog, capturing all of the signatures in one go. The Matrix VI test provides an in-depth analysis of the IC on the test and requires, again, no power. Instead of using the PCB ground as a reference, the system will use each pin as a temporary reference and compare it against every other pin of the device. On a 14-pin device, 196 signatures will be generated and analyzed by the system in a matter of seconds. This is a powerful comparison test that will reveal any alteration that has taken place inside of the device on the test. In a similar way, both the standard and Matrix VI can be run from the PCB connector. The results from the good board can be stored for later comparison and this test may help engineers locate the faulty sector of the PCB a lot more quickly.
Gate activated devices can also be simulated using the VI instrument on its pulse output channel. This test will check the exact triggering level on a good transistor for example and the result can be saved and compared against a faulty PCB. The system a short locator can be used to determine precisely the location of a short. It can also be used to confirm the track integrity, checking for the continuity between correlated points on a PCB. Now let's have a look at some power on tests available with the system eight range. Once it has been determined that the PCB can be safely powered up, there is a wide range of tests that can be carried out on a reference PCB unsaved for later comparison. From the edge connector, you will be able to drive logic signals, read voltage, generate VI signatures and save connection information. If a bit of nails is available, the test results can be collected from multiple test points at the same time. Checking whether the tiny discrete devices are working is now easy with the range of accessories and the vast library of parts already available with System 8. Applying power to a PCB is safer and more effective with the System 8 range. The built-in power supply is controlled by ABI's automate software and can be configured for example to show pass or fail if the amount of current being drawn by the PCB is above a certain predefined limit. The software can be programmed to stop the test there and then, avoiding further damage to be caused. ABI can supply test clips for virtually any type of package. You will be able to check, save and recall vital information from a good working IC such as voltage, connection, configuration, VI signatures and thermal references in a matter of seconds. This applies even in the case the device part number is unknown. Should you want to identify the function of a house-coded or unknown IC, the System 8 IC identifier will test the good working device to try unlocating a corresponding part or parts already in the library that meet the same function of this very IC. Any device from the given list can then be selected next time you need to functionally test this undefined IC, sometimes referred as black box. The logic test generator will help you develop custom functional tests for your logic devices and PCBs. Each channel can be configured to match the device's input-output requirements. The system will learn the results coming back from the good device or PCB, save and compare them. The test can run from a test clip, PCB connected or with the help of a bed of nails, also known as test fixture. Thousands of parts are already available in the System 8 library, which means logic ICs operating within plus or minus 10 volts can be functionally tested in circuit. 
operating under strict and safe limits defined in the military standard 0053, the functional or truth table test provides valuable information to determine whether or not the IC on the test needs to be replaced. Analog ICs can be equally functionally tested in circuit by choosing the part in the device library. Should you want to read and verify the contents of an EEPROM from a legacy board for later comparison, this is also possible with ABI's System 8. ABI System 8 offers a range of built-in high-specification instrumentation such as a 3-channel DSO, arbitrary function generator, frequency counter, multimeter, multi-channel, universal I.O. and more. Waveforms, test results as well as the instrument settings can be saved, drastically reducing test setup times. The System 8 range offers you the option to easily design custom instrument layouts or incorporate different test instruments into a practical virtual test station to suit your specific requirements. Custom layouts can be shared with other members of the team and test results can be saved and easily recalled using ABI's interactive test flow manager. Comparing signals is made easy using System 8 built-in instruments. The results, masks and tolerances as well as the instrument setup can be saved into an interactive test flow, reducing setup time and allowing lower level operators to run tests effectively. This concludes our System 8 applications video. For more information on ABI products and how to contact one of our distributors present in over 60 countries worldwide, visit our website abielectronics.co.uk. Thanks for watching.